The Voice Recap, the top 10 compete to make it into the semi-finals. It was Mother's Night on The Voice when the top 10 brought their mothers to meet their coaches Adam Levine, Alicia Keys, Blake Shelton, and Gwen Stefani. The competition was fierce because two contestants will be sent home this week, and only eight of the artists will make it into next week's semi-finals. Team Adams Minneapolis artist Jesse Larson kicked off the night, bringing the funk with Jungle Love by the time. Blake told him, It got so good, I was watching Alicia to see if she was going to combust. Alicia said, It is sometimes harder to sing songs like this because it is all about energy and attitude. When you play, I love seeing all sides of you. That was a great performance. Adam added, I might have made a mistake when I said this dude isn't a pop star, because he is a superstar. You shred on that guitar, you sing better than anyone, and you pulled off a song that depends on attitude. It was nasty. Next to perform was 15-year-old Leah Malden, who brought both her mom and her grandmother. She showed off her quiet side with the ballad Jealous by Labyrinth. Alia chose that song to dedicate to her father, whom she never knew and it brought her to tears. Gwent told her, you doing a song like that, at this point, is so smart. You have this whole vibe going and you pulled this song out that we didn't expect. Crying happens to all of us. You did a great job. You should be proud of yourself. Blake said, I literally could not be more proud of you. You did what you needed to do. You did what I asked you to do. You got lost in the moment and that is all anyone can expect an artist to do. Alicia called in a favor so that her artist Vanessa Ferguson could get permission to perform Do Wop, That Thing, by Lauren Hill. Adam said, Lauren Hill is impossible to emulate because she does everything. No one should dare do it. You need to start thinking about rapping a little bit. That was incredible. Alicia told her, first of all, you look stunning. The most incredible thing for me to learn about you is how much there is to you. You are a crazy vocalist, a pianist, a musician. You are everything, and now America knows there is no limit to you. Mark Isaiah followed Vanessa, performing the brand new single Sign of the Times by Harry Styles. Gwen said, I feel like that was a really interesting choice. This is a whole different side to you. Adam told him. That was his idea to do that song. I let him pick his songs because he has been doing such a great job. Every single week you get up there and you surprise me. Vote for this guy because I want to see him get better. Before the next top 10 artist took the stage, it was a timeout while Blake performed every time I hear that song. Then Team Alicia's Tennessee soul singer Chris Blue decided to loosen up and have fun with 24K Magic by Bruno Mars.